Today, my friends, it's all what you've been waiting for. The number one free-to-play player with your number one guide on star coral cookie topping and biscuits and everything that you need to know about this cookie in today's episode. Thank you for tuning in. As always, if you enjoy, make sure to like and subscribe. On top of that, if you get a question, if you get a comment, let us know because I'd love to hear from you as always. And certainly this cookie has been making waves, if not more, and you can hear about it on our Discord server as a great place. Now, with that, as always, down below, you'll find today's episode and timestamps where we will talk about Star Coral Cookie. We'll give you the biscuits and the toppings. We'll go for a run as we always do and showcase this particular cookie for you. Now, let's get into it here because we've got a lot of stuff to cover. All right, so a couple of things here. Star Coral Cookie, the latest and greatest here with the new update. Um, really, really fun. Definitely enjoying it. I hope you are as well. Um, on top of that, this cookie is a sport cookie, a rear cookie. Now, a couple things about this particular cookie, my friends. Here it is. Twinkling Coral. 14 second cooldown. Summons a Twinkling Coral to heal her allies, provide an HP shield, and increase their crit percent, attack speed, and amplify buff. The cookie's lantern will shine towards the enemies, dealing periodic damage. Star Coral Cookie's Lunar Lantern makes are immune to sleep and drowsy and will periodically restore the allies hp instead couple things here glowing corals periodic damage times 10 ticks over 1.2 seconds very very important there to remember we got tick damage yes so that is huge on certain enemies hint 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 keep that in mind um healing 11 percent of attack for every one second for seven seconds healing hp shield shield with 10 percent of max hp for 12 seconds crit percent there 17.5 for 12 seconds attack speed for 12 percent 20 percent for 12 seconds amplify buff 10 percent for 12 seconds immunity to stun 12 seconds um, immunity stun's really nice. Uh, Lunar Lantern healing, 10.5% of attack. We also have Star Coral here. Team gains the Star Coral effect, active for 12 seconds, attack plus 12%, HP 15%, damage resist 15, stacks up to one time. Couple things about this. 14 second cooldown, a lot of stuff at 12 seconds there. Um, so that's important to remember and everything else. Now, with that said though, again, as we talk about these guides, it's also based off what you have available and the, some of the strategies and, and things that you wanna apply. So we'll keep that in mind. First and foremost though, we need to, boom, level this thing up. Worthy of a 70. Let's go, my friends, boom. <laughs> And then let's let's also add all of our amazing experience. Boom, look at that, we got so much. All right, so that's the first piece. If you need a guide on how to get experience, you can check it out here on the channel. All right, now a couple things on this. That's the first piece. Let's see if we can make it on our max here as well. We'll see, oh, not quite, not quite. All right, we'll go to 70, but you can see that 93.3% damage, do you see that? That's what we're getting. We're getting more damage by leveling this thing up. Don't forget it. All right, there we go. Boom, we will do that. We gotta go find some more of those. Yep. All right, anyway, that's the first thing that you're gonna wanna do. Make sure you get your cookie maxed, as always. Um, on top of that, let's go check out our biscuit. So the first piece on the biscuit here is, A, get a legendary on this cookie if you can. Um, let's see what we got here. We like all these on all of our other cookies, so we'll just leave it off. For now, well, no, we're gonna swap it. Let's do this. Uh, let's do damage resist bypass. I like it, and attack speed. We're gonna do this right here. Boom. Because we had damage, right? All right, so a couple of things on this because we're playing with this one. We got a fun guide um, and tip and trick. Obviously, they're at level 21. I'm not gonna give you the hint there. You can check out the video. Now, a couple things on this in particular here when it comes to star coral cookies biscuits first and foremost um damage you saw that damage piece this is the only spot you will get damage resist bypass so important to keep in mind however a little bit different as a support cookie i do like this particular one that i have so that's why i picked this one and put it on star coral cookie now what do you want to pay attention to on this one in particular a couple things you definitely want to make sure um, that you do have cooldown now we'll talk a little bit about this when we get to our toppings um, so cooldown absolutely the other big pieces are attack and hp 
that TAC and HP are gonna scale all those other pieces that we saw as well. Now, additionally there, you may want survivability. If this thing's really squishy, you're gonna also wanna consider damage resist. So you got lots of good ones there in terms of consideration for you and how you build out your uh, hardy biscuit here. And then additionally, that damage resist bypass, we're gonna leave it on for fun because that's what I wanna do here today. However, again, lots of great ideas. You can also consider that amplified buff too. Don't forget that, my friends. Um, so some very interesting ideas for that. Now, again, just by purely putting this on, getting it maxed out, you're gonna get a nice boost from attack and HP. Perfect. Now, what does that mean in terms of our toppings? Well, my friends, we got something fun here for you in toppings today. First and foremost, a couple things about this. You can absolutely um, use these right here, your moon kiss toppings. And yes, look at this. Star Coral Cookie is eligible for this. It is one of the things that I called out, I think, potentially in the patch notes um, for this update. But Star Coral Cookie is able to use this. Now, you are going to want to balance it out against your team. However, this is a great candidate to use this. I am going to use them. And I am going to use these ones right here. Moon Kissed Chocolates. Yes. So let's go ahead. We're going to claim five of these. Boom. Let's do it. And now we're going to go back to our cookie here, wherever you went, cookie, because now we need to find you at level 80. There you are. All right. We're going to go to our toppings. And then we're going to go find those special ones, wherever you are. Probably somewhere down here. Or I can sort. <laughs> I can sort, where'd you go? There they are, look at that, I found them. Multiple upgrade, oh no. We'll find them again real quick, sorry. Filtering, filtering, user error on filtering. That is correct, all right, there they are. All right, one, two, three, four, five. Um, Go to 12, absolutely get these. Okay, so here is the strategy that we are running, particularly, again, given a lot of the other things that I talked about um, with this particular cookie, um, you could consider some other ideas like adding HP or attack, um, amplifying the buff, add some additional ideas. However, the key one here is really you are going to absolutely spam and want to spam this move set. So this is why we go like this and add these into this particular cookie. So now you're not gonna have to worry about this and also that damage, attack, the ticks, all that stuff. Um, spam it, spam it, spam it. Now, a couple things here in terms of ours, you can see we got more attack, we got some crit, we got great damage resist, look at that. Look at that, really, really nice. Um, damage resist, which is great. Additional cooldown, which is great. We didn't get a ton of attack and we didn't get a ton of HP. So in this consideration, in terms of balancing out my uh, moon kiss toppings here, radiant resonant toppings, as we like to call them, specialty toppings for this cookie, you're gonna wanna focus more on that HP and attack potentially on your biscuit as an example. So those are key pieces. Now, additionally, you can use, you don't have to use those. Um, you can absolutely use your regular Swift chocolate. Um, now, if you're looking to get some of these, the other tip and trick on this, um, we do have guides on these things, but right now with the new update, you can get these um, pretty readily in the uh, special uh, story mode, all those things and some of the gotcha, uh, events, those kinds of things. So check those things out. All right, now back to our regularly scheduled program here, Star Coral Cookies Toppings. We've now talked about the biscuit. We've talked about the toppings. We've given you some blended strategy, ideas, tips, tricks to consider. Um, if you don't have Moon Kissed, what you should do as well and how you wanna think about it across these two. It is time for us to move towards our run. So we're gonna to go to our world exploration mode as we always do. We got lots of great guides here on the channel for you. I will never stop saying that ever. All right, um, we're gonna to go to 8 Hall of Enlightenment. I am gonna try 829 here um, solo, yes, to start, because I wanna see if it works. Um, if not, we'll find someone else to run with Star Coral Cookie. Maybe Sea Fairy. All right, or Moonlight. All right, there we go. So we're gonna remove this, we're gonna run with this. 382, lots of attack here. Can Star Coral Cookie run this thing by themselves? Find out. As we 
Wait. Swag. Ooh, I like that. Swag merch is available to him. Look at that. Massive hit. Fast attack. Holy cow. Let's see what this does to the last boss. You can see all these things here as well. It's not stacking, but this stun immunity is very nice. Eight second cooldown for us too, by the way. Ooh, this is a stunner. Look at that. One shot on the boss. We didn't even see the damage. I love it. Great, great takedown here with this particular cookie. Absolutely, my friends. You want to make sure that you're getting all that stuff going and action packed. Whew, that was a awesome one. Now, with that, my friends, that concludes our episode here today and topping guide for you as well when it comes to all things star coral cookie if you still have a question if you got a comment let me know because i'd love to hear from you as always and would love to see you in our amazing community and discord server lots of players like i said having fun with this one and this is your topping guide for you to break it all down all right now on top of that again no pun intended if you uh not only have questions i just want to say Thank you. Thank you for tuning in today. I appreciate your support. Thank you for the likes and the subs as we continue to grow this amazing community here. Um, on top of that, if... Uh, oh, thank you to all of our members as well. I'm saying on top of too much toppings on my mind. Um, thank you to all of our members. As always, I truly appreciate that. We have memberships available. Like I sw said, swag and merch also and affiliate links. Something for everyone. Um, I encourage you to check it out. It's a nice way to support. So thank you. Uh, don't forget our socials at me, chat me, stay connected. Discord servers popping as always. Uh, additionally, my friends, enjoy Star Coil Cookie. If you enjoy the gotcha, best of luck on that as always. And you can check our gotcha episode out as well here on the channel. Till next time, we'll see you again soon. Keep on running. And good luck with Star Coral Cookie.